Subject, Ben Tennyson, a young hero with the unique ability to transform into various alien forms, each with its own set of extraordinary powers. His primary tool is the Omnitrix, a sophisticated piece of alien technology that allows him to access the DNA of different alien species and become them. Ben's arsenal includes a diverse range of aliens, each with abilities ranging from super strength, speed, and agility, to more exotic powers like energy manipulation, elemental control, and even reality warping. His most notable transformations include Forearms, a Tetramand with immense strength, XLR-8, a Kine Kelleran with incredible speed, Diamond Head, a Petrosapien with Crystallokinesis, and Heat Blast, a Pyronite with Pyrokinesis. However, the most formidable and potentially dangerous transformation Ben possesses is an alien species known as Celestial Sapien, capable of reality manipulation on a universal scale. This alien form, which I theorize exists but do not have a confirmed name for, could potentially erase or recreate reality. The implications of facing such a power are daunting. For all I know, the reality I currently exist in could have been altered or even created by this being. Furthermore, there are alternate versions of Ben Tennyson, each with different versions of the Omnitrix, such as the Ultimatrix, which grants evolved forms of his aliens, and a rumored Negatrix, a counterpart with possibly malevolent intentions. In developing contingency plans against Ben Tennyson, I must account for these variables. Firstly, to counter Ben Tennyson's diverse alien abilities, I will develop an adaptive combat suit. This suit will integrate various defensive and offensive technologies to counter each of Ben's known alien forms. For example, against a pyronite form like Heat Blast, the suit would activate a heat-resistant shielding. Against a tetramend like Forearms, it would enhance my strength and durability. The suit's AI would analyze and adapt in real time to whichever form Ben transforms into, ensuring that I'm always equipped to counter his abilities effectively. Secondly, while engaging Ben in combat, a secondary strategy involves deploying nanobots. These microscopic machines would be designed to infiltrate the Omnitrix undetected. They would be programmed to remain dormant until a crucial moment, slowly integrating with the Omnitrix's systems. My goal would be to stall Ben in combat, allowing the nanobots enough time to infiltrate the device. Lastly, my surveillance has revealed that the Omnitrix has a finite transformation duration, typically allowing Ben to maintain an alien form for 10 to 20 minutes before entering a 5-minute recharge mode. This recharge period is Ben's vulnerability window. Should he manage to evade capture in his base form during these 5 minutes, the previously deployed nanobots would initiate their final protocol, inducing a malfunction in the Omnitrix that extends its recharge period indefinitely effectively preventing Ben from transforming. In addition to these plans, there's the uncertainty surrounding the Celestial Sapien form. Its potential to bypass the Omnitrix's limitations poses a significant risk. Therefore, a crucial part of my strategy involves preventing Ben from triggering this transformation. This might require a combination of psychological tactics and rapid incapacitation strategies. Despite these contingency plans, it's important to recognize Ben Tennyson's potential as a hero. Under different circumstances, and devoid of the guiding influence of his family, particularly Grandpa Max, Ben could have been a valuable addition to my team. His resilience, adaptability, and inherent sense of justice align with the values we uphold.